The arts education teaching sequence is the core of the VAPA program. It's where a student can go from theory to observation to practice, where they get to implement a completely unique and original arts-based lesson plan in a K-12 classroom in LAUSD. M102 is the first of three courses in the arts education teaching sequence, and this course provides an overview of arts education for multiple publics in inner city settings through the lens of social justice. Students learn basic theories of arts education and artistic development. Students are also creating team micro-teaching experiences for their peers and receiving feedback. In micro-teaching, all the groups are assigned to a lesson plan and we have to implement that lesson plan in 25 minutes. Um, and so it could be on anything. One group did shadow puppets. Mm -hmm. For digital media, it was super cool. Before I took this class, I, I kind of felt like art wasn't as important as like math or English, like my core classes that I need. And taking this class made me realize that is not a separate discipline, that you need art to do well in English, to do well in math, to do well in science, because I'm a visual and a kinetic learner. And when we do projects, we're doing art. So M192 is the second course in the three course sequence. Um, this is the course in which students are really beginning to commit and are well on their way towards a minor in arts education. We work to pair students with different arts disciplines, different classes, and guiding teachers all across Los Angeles. You're becoming the artist, teaching artist that you want to be. So all, like when you create your teaching philosophy paper and everything that you want to do as a teacher, you're able to actually implement that in the second quarter. I really, I'm teaching music and I want that to be hands-on and I want that to be accessible. I craft my lessons so that it can be just that. I'm looking forward to teaching children about uh, developing visual literacy skills uh, through the arts and just kind of looking around our visual culture around us and kind of, okay, well, what does this mean if we're only seeing a lot of X or a lot of Y? And Working towards service learning in M192SL, students um, are actually in the classrooms implementing all of the theories and ideas and lessons that they've developed over the um, two earlier courses. VAPA teaching sequence has helped me become a stronger teaching artist by enlightening me in terms of in which ways to approach teaching. Starting being in public school growing up, I always thought there was kind of one way to teach. Joining VAPA kind of blew my mind and expanded my way of understanding how education can actually be. In doing that, that I feel like I can actually grow even further now than I could have before. Some of the challenges that I've overcome as a teaching artist have been how to manage a classroom of 37 students and being one teacher in the room because in my head it was always going to be a smaller group of students that I was going to teach to. So when I walk into the classroom, it's not a very big space, but it feels big in the sense that there are these beautiful, bold personalities and of 37 students and I want to tend to each one of them. In my experience, the, the three main takeaways that students achieve as a result of this sequence are confidence, adaptability, community.